series statement with a highly impressive performance to take the opening. The TNT first round is presented by State Farm. We are set game two between the Portland. Ozzo and of course the addition, as you mentioned, of Aaron Gordon. Two-way play from C.J. McCollum because he's the guy that ends up with that block shot on the drive by Rivers and then able to knock down that trip. And that's so key, the ability to play without the basketball. So vital. A nice attack by Composite. Yet that, you know, it was Nurkic. She was the first-round pick of those <laughs> two and thought to be the better player, but it was quickly uh, figured out that the Joker had a chance. Great job of contesting being physical and then turning that great defense into transition opportunities. It's exactly the kind of start Michael Malone was looking for. And another Blazers turnover. Lillard the giveaway. Outside to Porter, trying to thread the needle to Gordon. Yeah. Portland Trail Blazers, fewest turnovers per game in the league, just over 11 per of that championship team a couple of years ago. And that ends a 10 nothing run. And you know, you make a great come, but Portland more in that win now mode, and Powell gives them a little more versatility. Although I thought Gary Trent solid defensively, Powell can be a, a real difference maker on that end and just gives the ball in his hands a little bit short. Rebound Jokic, and he is knocked to the floor. No whistle. Jokic then reaching back for it, somehow comes away with the basketball. Here's Rivers, they'll reset. Campazzo from three. That's good. And the Denver Nuggets with a shooting clinic here at the start. Timeout, Portland. Tibbetts, keep an eye on your top of your picture here. Just as Denver was coming to their bench, there was some drawing going on. Damian Lillard was into it. And there is Tibbetts from the top of the screen from Portland's bench. A technical foul. Covington. Here's Jokic. Underneath, outside, Campazzo. Steps back, fires a three. A little bit short. Here's Rivers out front, and Jokic hits the deck. Didn't appreciate that contact. My boy Tepper starting to flare early on. Officials doing their best. But right now, trying to stick it to his old team. Here's Monte Morris, puts it on the deck to the rim. Rim protecting team, so opportunities are going to be there, especially with Nikola out there, because you don't want to take a body off of him if you're Nurkic. Here's Jokic, fires and hit. Jokic already four of five. He's got ten points. Tight from half court and shove him and just heave him up there. He shot that in rhythm. That is what you call taking matters into your own hands. Just unbelievable. And so you're out there in essence on an island by yourself, and the skill level of these guys today is just off. Beyond Morris. And a clean strip on that play. Just trying to keep it close here after some hot shooting at the start by Denver. Lillard creating the space at a 67% clip. And right now have opened up an 18-point lead. Lillard! It is incredible. Ken Lillard get them back. Is looking pretty good. That's their fifth three now. And they got away with a kickball. See Lillard's numbers, his fourth three, 16 for the game. Gives that group confidence. And now let's see if Denver can answer. Lillard again. in that first game, which was really impressive to go along with the points. Already four here tonight. So giving great balance between the playmaking. Scored the Blazers last 12. Was that fan duel? Was the over under just <laughs> on Dane Willard or because he might do that bomb? Those injuries. Jokic off balance. Doesn't matter with him. Off balance, on balance. You always expect that to go down. Portland another turnover. Their ninth in the first of this quarter. Campazzo from downtown. He has tied an NBA playoff record held by Vince Carter. And we still have a lot of back for Denver. And let's give Denver some grab. I mean, they got 70 points in this first half. <laughs> Off balance three. Lillard, 32 points. Drive and kick into the corner. Anthony. Seven to shoot. Anthony. 
with you, partner. Let's see if there's an encore. Norman Powell, a little bit too much on a three-pointer. Fight for the rebound in the paint. Longer with that basketball, making sure you have quality possessions and then also matching. Now to McCollum into the corner. This is Powell. Blazers desperately needed that three. And you talked about adjustments, Spiro. One of the adjustments is Composite picks up the foul there that Michael Mo putting some size, giving him a different look in the first few possessions. They've had some success there. Yeah, that, that was a foul. <laughs> so Compazzo, third quarter in game one before they completely flipped the scripts. How does this one end tonight here in game? I see Aaron Gordon taken. Eight points for Gordon. Compazzo, the theft. Here he comes to the wreck, lays it up and in. And Denver answering. And that adjustment of putting Aaron Gordon on gets the friendly mouse and Compazzo doing what he does best, just active defensively and finishing in the open floor. Anything was limited, and they get rewarded. Portland Trail Blazers, the number six seed in the West, finished the regular season, winning 10 of their final 12. There's a whistle blown underneath. Jokic with his. He does a terrific job of that for the Nuggets. A beautiful backdoor cut. Going to your move there. Another uncharacteristic turnover. First on McCollum. A lot of what they were missing with those players and more. What an addition he's been. Ball broken up. Can they save it on the baseline? And the officials say last touch by Denver. Morris does not like that call. But great hustle there. That was the right call. Good call there. Great effort. You love it when guys are just selling out, understanding the importance of each and every possession. Boy, we've seen tempers flare multiple times in this game. And it just always seems like Campazzo is right in the middle of things. And and it looks go. like they're going to take a look at the replay. Campazzo, Adam is about warning. CJ McCollum agrees. Just he's a disruptor, he's an agitator. What a story he's been 30 years. And you can see there. But Compazzo landed kind of right in the, the leg of Jokic. Hopefully no injury. And hopefully, GA, this will be a a brief review. I, 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 I got to call the legal track of what's really important because even right there, like Compasso walks into McCollum, so you have every right to your space. Nice. Center Our review tonight. is the flagrant foul penalty one has been assessed to McCollum. Wow, that that is. And then McCollum in kind walks back into his space, and I just think that. There's no place for that stuff in our game. We, we need flagrant fouls, and we want to limit that. You could call a tag. I don't understand flagrant in a situation. Make the opening round of the playoffs. Here's Jokic fading away, and it's... I want to cut it. 2-11. Here's Morris into the paint. Here, the, the psychology of a seven game series, the pendulum swings. We're also quick to think a series maybe is headed in one direction. As Denver has answered the bell so far here in game two. Jokic from Covington. 32 for Jokic. He's got eight rebounds. Damian Lillard just eight for so many different parts of Jokic's game to marvel at. Yeah, the other thing that not enough people talk about, he played in all 72 games this year. No nights off. No injury management. Kind of a throwback, something that's been a rarity. And here he comes again. The time playoffs rebounds list. The great Dan Issel. One of the all-time names 
in Nuggets franchise history. Jokic thought about it. Now to Campazzo. That's an open three. And he hits. Have made their statement here in game two. How about through the eight hole there by Campazzo. Jokic, beautiful finish. And Marcus Howard would be playing big minutes for us a month ago. I would have, I would have laughed. So nothing against those guys. Loves them both, but I gotta say, first of all, thank you to Monte Morris for putting yeah. a microphone on tonight for us in a playoff game. How did he get up from that collision? Yeah, that the sound of it hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> I would have been a week in the hospital oh, for me, Gio. Goodness. What a night for Morris. He has been huge for them off the bench. 12 points, seven assists in a reserve role. He's become such a reliable backup spot starter for Michael Malone the last couple of years. And Jokic was to bed at least for 48 hours. I'll tell you what, I, I'm as impressed with what Michael Malone and Denver Douglas did tonight as anything I've seen thus far early in the postseason. Great effort, both sides of the ball. 